Hi, I'm Amy Brooks. I live in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, and this is my story. It's an absolute miracle that I am even here today. Um, my birth mother had three abortions before me. Um, as she was out of the country, she feared that she was going to miscarry me and was given a concoction of medicines um, to try and prevent the miscarriage. Because of that, I was born with a condition known as tetrafocomelia, which basically means having no arms or legs. Because of my birth condition, I was abandoned by my birth mother. Um, she didn't want to have anything to do with me. Um, one of the other family members even suggested placing me in a room and not feeding me. At the age of two, I was adopted by Janet and Richard Brooks. And from the very beginning, my parents went into a covenant with God and they asked him to guide them and to show them how to raise somebody like me because obviously it was, I was <laughs> nothing that they had had before. And from then on, um, you know, God just showed my mom how to, how to help me do things like sit up and, and roll over and normal things that, you know, babies and toddlers have to do. There are definitely challenges in my everyday living. Everything from even brushing my teeth to, you know, uncovering it in the morning, walking, brushing my hair, getting dressed, writing, texting. For a girl putting on your makeup, most people don't think about it when they're doing it. I can do all of those things. I just have to find a, a different way to do it and, and God has definitely helped me to see those ways and, and if I can't figure it out the first time, he helps me think of another way to do it. Logic is my service dog. She actually helps with some of those things and in the morning she uncovers me and uh, um, she turns lights on and off for me when I can't, the ones that I can't reach. She also helps me to get upstairs so that I'm free to go upstairs to my room whenever I feel like it. She opens the trap door for me and closes it and then um, you know, my stair lift takes me up and down. Life growing up in the Brooks family was um, to me normal. I wasn't treated uh, any differently by my siblings. They didn't, they didn't treat me like there was something wrong with me. I took the dishes to the kitchen when I was done eating. Um, I helped clean and fold laundry and, and everything that my brothers and sisters did, I did too. And um, you know, they included me in on everything. I believe that, you know, God doesn't make mistakes. Uh, I wasn't a mistake, even though my birth parents may have thought I was. and. Um, you know, some doctors thought I was. They told my parents that I would never amount to anything. You know, I would be strapped to a chair my whole life and I wouldn't be able to do anything. I wouldn't be independent. They'd have to feed me and, and take care, complete care of me. But, um, you know, God doesn't make mistakes and, and He had other plans for me. I serve uh, in the local church um, because I love people. I love being around them. I love the one-on-one. -on -one. I like to serve and, and to help people to, to see their purpose and that God has a purpose for them. And that if I can do things like painting and, you know, brushing my hair as little of a task as that is with somebody, you know, with hands, if I can do those things, then, then anybody, you know, can do what they're called to do. And it's just stepping out and, and taking that first step and believing God for what He has for them.